Do you love a good glass of wine or a cold beer after a long day? While alcohol can be an enjoyable part of socializing or relaxing, it's important to be aware of how it can affect your health, specifically your triglycerides. In this video, we'll be revealing the truth about the relationship between alcohol and triglycerides. Can alcohol really increase your triglycerides? How much is too much? Stay tuned to find out more. Triglycerides are a type of fat found in the bloodstream, and high levels of triglycerides can increase your risk of heart disease. So, it's important to be mindful of how much alcohol you consume. Certain types of alcohol, such as sweet cocktails and mixed drinks, can be high in calories and contribute to weight gain and high triglycerides. To help maintain healthy triglyceride levels, choose low-calorie options like light beer, wine, and spirits mixed with low-calorie mixers. Alcohol can contribute to high triglycerides in several ways. First, certain alcohol contains calories, and when we consume more calories than our body needs, our body converts these excess calories into triglycerides and stores them in fat cells. This can lead to weight gain and higher triglyceride levels. Second, alcohol can interfere with the liver's ability to process triglycerides. When the liver is busy processing alcohol, it may not be able to effectively remove excess triglycerides from the bloodstream, leading to higher levels. For these reasons, it's important to be mindful of how much alcohol you consume and to choose low-calorie options when possible to help maintain healthy triglyceride levels. But how much is too much? The American Heart Association recommends that men limit their alcohol intake to no more than two drinks per day and women to no more than one drink per day. One drink is equivalent to 12 ounces of beer, five ounces of wine, or one and a half ounces of hard liquor. So if you're looking to keep your triglycerides in check, it's a good idea to limit your alcohol intake and choose low calorie options when possible. Thanks for watching. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more health and wellness content.